Hello, ladies and gents. I am the Rev. Welcome on back to more of the Outer Worlds Peril on Gorgon. And we last left off. We had just gotten here. And I figured we'd, you know, enjoy ourselves and do a little looting before we uh, go any further. Not that much loot, though. Careful. Those trigger fingers look a mighty itchy. Hey, you. Over here. It's chat. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's Riz. Ah, oh, fucking damn it. Every time. So, uh, hey, you trespassing. And I'm armed. Maybe take a second look at your life choices, pal. Nothing. Never mind. What, you gonna report me? I don't work for them no more. I'm with the gardeners now. All of us kept the peace for the corpse once, but we got tired of being used. Horticulturist, don't. <laughs> hey, I like to get my hands dirty. Shit. It's just a name. Old lady we work for, she likes plants. We're here to keep the streets clean. <sighs> Hallways. You know what I mean. Anyway, Blakesley's given us standing orders to strongly discourage anyone who tries to come in. Oh, I'm gonna have to fight I to like her. I like to, uh, extrapolate from there. Wonder what that is. Let's see. We ain't subversives. We're gainfully employed. This is a private contract. Miss Junlei can't get too mad if we rough up some trespassers. Especially if I was nice enough to warn him first. Still this trying deal to be with nice. Blakesley's pretty sweet. We get paid and we get fresh greens every week. My gums never looked healthier. <laughs> what? Ah, shit. Insurance, you said? Fine, I did talk my guess. way out of it. Holy shit. <laughs> Look, we won't give you trouble, but I can't say the same about Blakesley. She's got some crazy setup in there, so if you get shot, don't come complaining to me. Cool. Well, once we get in, clear, we'll... Guys. Nice work, Cap. Like I don't know what to do with myself. You know, I kind of remember this area. Kind of. Going silent. What the? Staying with his puppy, huh? Because if no one's gonna say anything, I'm just gonna grab stuff. Yeah, we did come through here before. Okay, so this is just a repurposed area. Oh, what do we got here? Okay. Ah. You have to be kidding me. I thought I made myself quit. Wait, what's with this camera? Hello? Damn it. Look, I get it. spelled out for them. I'm sure one of the auto mechanicals can explain. tells me that's the problem are the auto mechanicals that's who her guards are gonna be uh 
Oh, wow, it doesn't tell us anything. Oh, are you handsome. Looks like you got yourself a little snack. <sighs> yeah, yeah, like a human head or something, huh? Okay, let's see if we can cause some havoc here. I just steal everything. We have it down this way. The exit. So yeah, we gotta go. It looks like guns are blazing here. Let's see. Against robots. Electricity works the best. Well. Ugly little monster. It's kind of cute. He wakes up. He listens for that bell three times a day. Food rains from the sky. He eats. He waits. Life is easy. But the second your molt comes in, pal. Hmm. So many goodies to grab. Ooh, an elevator. Hmm. Pretty useless in there. Oh, what's this? I don't know because I can't hack it. Damn. Well, 95. Jeez, man. You make it look so easy. There we go. Still gotta go more that way, huh? All right, well, can we get through there? Yeah, okay, what's this other door go to? Okay, so that's two elevators now.
You hear that humming? Sounds like some kind of generator. What can I do for you, Mr. Home Invasion? Let's see. Spacer's Choice send you? Took your sweet time. Gorgon? I holed up in a forgotten cargo bay of a rotting colony ship just so I could never hear that name again. But here you are. I really didn't expect today to go this way. Shit. I should have brought another pack of smokes. Mm. The Gorgon Project gave us Adrena time in the end, but that's just the Bow Spacer's choice stuck on the whole mess. Corporate demanded a product they could throw onto shelves. That put the squeeze on low at Cam to develop formulas. Samples. But how do you know if the product works? You run tests, see what happens. That's where human inquiry and auditing came in. I ran HIA, and HIA ran the tests again and again and again. And what happens is a whole lot of wasted time and even more bodies. You met the gardeners. They're nothing but overgrown canids, but people love their fancy names. We were looking for a game changer, something to better the colony. It felt important, worth a few sacrifices. Jeez. Spacer's choice. They wanted to sell that change for as many bits as they could. None of us got what we wanted. Yeah, because none of you should be screwing around with this crap. Oh, well. You've heard the adverts, right? Work day and night, still feel refreshed the next morning. Now, what we tested for was dexterity, efficiency, compliance. The traits of a good employee. <laughs> Numbers never came out right. I could have pumped gallons of those chemicals into every living soul in this colony. Wouldn't have changed that. What we got was marauders. Yeah, good luck making that one stick. It's in the fine print, you know. Whatever was in those chemicals, it didn't matter what test we ran. We kept getting the same results. The proto-adrena time solution was both monstrously addictive and had catastrophic effects on the psyche and intellect. A real boon to the colony. <laughs> yeah, I wonder why they closed we it. We had a few weird accidents, escapes, minor setbacks. But one day, all the test subjects got loose. Sabotage, they said. It wasn't just us. All of the facilities got hit hard. Shut us down for a while. That turned out to be the last straw. Nah, didn't much care by then. Don't care much now. Hmm. Spacer's choice wasn't getting much use out of us anymore, so they shuttered the project, kicked Adrena time out the door. And I came here. Indulge a scientist. What do you want out of this investigation of yours? Trying to liven up your memoir? Just <sighs> trying to spice up chapter three. <laughs> That's funny. Um. Really? What good can that possibly do? Break the at company. At least the wildlife won't give you any trouble. What do you get out of headbutting murderous auto mechanicals for your captain here? I've been helping folks out of scrapes for as long as I can remember. And the captain's one of the rare few that returns the favor. Fair enough. That's all I've got. Here. I still have this pass. Don't much feel like hanging on to it anymore. Made my exit the moment the project started falling apart. Had to steal some credentials. This should get you into the volunteer induction entrance.
please. I just messaged people with fake demands for their passwords. That's when they didn't just leave codes written down on pieces of paper. <laughs> if I couldn't talk my way out past a simple facility lockdown, I'd be working for Rizzo's. That'll get you inside. What you do from there, that's up to you. Come on, I've left it behind me. Yeah, well, you have to go on, don't you? Guilt's a useless emotion. What good is thinking about the past over and over and over again? Please, I don't need... Fine. Fine, here, I remember one of my access codes. Just punch in the keypad equivalent for replication. Should get you into the offices. Maybe get you to my terminal a little sooner. Oh, okay. Go test that persistence of yours out on Gorgon. Oh, I will. Oh, I'm not going to attack her. Yeah, yeah. I'll make sure the auto mechanicals don't bother you on the way out. I already killed them all. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Observation log. They... Well, never mind. Hybridization efforts have proven successful, and the nursery's yield is improving steadily. All right, let's get rid of our Meanwhile, junk. Meanwhile, the psychological benefits of gardening are difficult to assess without a control loop. Subjective reflection suggests minor gains in memory retention and contentment. Okay. Well, this armor's pretty beefy that I'm wearing. But, I can get this one up to the same level as this one pretty easily. Ooh, and I look so much cooler. Because that's what's important, folks. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Journal. Okay. Well, what is this store to? The John. Okay. Yeah, we could have slaughtered all these guys. Step up from force factories, huh? Doesn't look like either of us. Wonder, because on this side there should be stuff we can steal. One sec, let me go up here. You gotta shoot or what? We'll see how a spacer's choice cadet takes care of a. Uh... I think it's jammed! <laughs> or how? Brother. So he's a highly trained soldier, huh? Maybe if I beg, they'll let me back. Well, I like your armor, dude. There we go. An unknown vessel is approaching our ship. Their intentions are currently indeterminate. Once I deduce their intentions, I will play one of two audio signals. A cheerful fanfare if they are friendly, alarms if they are hostile. Their intentions are no longer unknown. Oh, shit. The unknown vessel has deployed a boarding mechanism. They will attach themselves to our airlock and attempt boarding shortly. That sound indicates that a boarding mechanism has successfully attached to our airlock. But well, we don't have to kill him. I am pleased to inform you that we are currently in the process of being boarded.
Captain Hawthorne installed a lethal shock trap on our airlock in the event of an invasion. I am prepared to deploy this trap at a moment's notice. The invading ship appears to be a decommissioned storage vessel. The crew are either pirates or freelancers. My opinion of their competence is low. Hmm. That is unlikely. Judging by the state of the invading ship and the competence of the boarding party, I deduce they are incapable of paying for dinner. Their ship is using a tracking device too sophisticated for their primitive astrogator. I conclude they are receiving outside assistance. If you prefer to make an escape, I can disable their boarding mechanism. However, as long as that tracking device remains on board their ship, they will be able to find us again. Yes, Captain. I am capable of deploying the Unreliable's articulated thrusters to dislodge their ship from our own. This is a temporary solution, however. A permanent solution may require your personal intervention. Understood, Captain. I will be deploying the Unreliable's lethal deterrence system. Please approach the airlock and enjoy the show. <laughs> okay, we gotta go see this. <laughs> now initiated. Get him away! Is that it? Should do that again? Do return in one piece, Captain. Looks like our opponent knows how to play defense. All right. Fall back and regroup. Coach Stiley's credentials, huh? Coach? We gotta find a coach of some sorts. I think I'm gonna clear this whole uh, ship first, then we'll come back and steal everything. I wanna try and get this ship cleared before. We go, uh. We end an episode. Some. Mother girl, get some too. Now it says it's under. What the hell? goodies we're gonna find there we go you know I'm a little disappointed I was hoping you'd play by the rules we could have had a good old-fashioned boarding now you're barging into my office muddy and tracks all over my floor a little respect for the ship 
Is that too much to ask? Yeah, yeah but I had every intention of respecting the upholstery. I would have had you spaced or shot in the bathroom or something. Jesus. You're the captain of the Unreliable. You dropped out of the sky in Emerald Vale, and whatever you've been doing on Gorgon, you've upset my employer. You and I are in a bit of a situation. I don't get paid unless you're dead. And a man's got to make a living. You understand. Punk. Get my way, girls. Okay. So they were like a uh, stupid little baseball team or something. Death hands, Cap. I love how they cheer me on when I steal. That's just awesome. Okay. So now we gotta go back down. Oh, somebody's room. Oh, somebody's... Hitting the iron. God, something I need to do. What is that? Ew. Sure, why not? Now it says it's barred. Oh. That is not helpful at all. I'm gonna have to go back and have, ask Adep for help. Wanted to freaking do it on my own though. machine gun cuz everybody should have a machine gun go jeez okay Alrighty, folks, so I'm going to go through and pick up everything so I can sell it. So when we come back next time, we shall go to where is it? Ah, man in high orbit. So please keep your heads down, your guns up, and I'll see you again real damn soon.